Hello and welcome! If you want to find out how to create furry tennis ball accent nail, stay with me! Let's go down to the tennis court and talk it up like yeah! My name is Anastasia, I post nail art tutorials, nail tech secrets and other tricks, so if you are new here, consider subscribing. And I will start this design by applying white gel polish as the background, one layer is enough here, then I will cure it in LED for one minute, and then I apply neon yellow gel polish. And yes, we could apply it just by itself, but it looks so much brighter when you have white background underneath. Then I will cure it again for one minute and then I will take a grey gel polish and create lines imitating the tennis ball. If you don't have grey, simply mix white and black together. Cure it again and then with a darker shade of the grey I will outline them again to make them look more real and cure in LED again for one minute. Then I will seal it all with a top coat and this time you need to use top coat with a sticky layer, it might be gel polish or gel top coat, cure it again. Then I will need tack free top coat, it's very important, and I will apply it not on the whole nail but only on the yellow areas, excluding the grey lines. And then, without curing, I am taking the yellow flock for nail art, I mixed a little bit of green there because I couldn't find neon anywhere, then get rid of the excess flock carefully, do not smudge it at the moment, and then we need to cure it in LED. I really love how neon shines in LED lights. And now with a brush I'm simply removing the excess flux, making sure the surface is clean. As we already sealed this design with a top coat, at this moment the design is finished. So now we have this fluffy furry tennis ball nail. And to complete the design I decided to add a small tennis ball on the white background on the ring finger and cover the rest of the nails with a neon gel polish. Let me know guys what do you think about these tennis nails, would you like to make them for yourself or maybe for your clients? And do not forget to subscribe not to miss my future future tutorials, tips and tricks and other nail related stuff. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye! Let's go down to the